Hi everyone, I am Candace Moore. I am here with Mr. Shy. Hi. And we are the collaborators who helped Juan Belmonte write So Inside My League. I did the lyrics and he did the melody to go with Juan's music. Yes, and uh, I'm down here. Uh, to, uh... Turn left on Hillcrest Parkway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in wonderful Virginia. Um, Virginia uh, Beach, to be Virginia exact. Virginia Beach, to be exact. Uh, near what, Chesapeake? Yes. This is Candon Smore here with the one and only Mr. Shy. Hi. And we are on location in Virginia again. And we wanted to give our fans a little bit of a background on how So Inside My League became a song. Because it was a real process that went on for several months to make the whole thing happen. I'll let you tell the story. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it started uh, with Juan Belmonte. Juan yeah. Belmonte, um, he has his record label, Juan, De Juan Belmonte Music in, in Spain. He's won three Grammys. Um, uh, with uh, Cher, Ricky Martin, uh, the names are endless, and uh, he's now running his own record label, as, as Candace just uh, told you. And uh, so yeah, he, we, I worked with him a few years back, and now we're collaborating again. And um, I think the story goes, from what I remember, he had gone to he had gone to church one day. He had gone to mass, yeah. and he was thinking about the twenty third Psalm. And he got inspired to write this piece of music that was just very bare bones musical concept. And it was just very like um, assertive and confident and just had kind of a cockiness to it. And he immediately thought of your voice as just the perfect smooth guy to compliment mm -hmm. the song. And so then he kind of reached out to you and he says in passing, oh, by the way, it's based on 23rd Psalm and you're just like, whatever. And so then you go, well, wait a second, I know someone that, that might be meaningful Immediately, to Immediately, yeah, I thought of you. And we'd already collaborated on uh, videos. Yes, you, we had done script writing done, videos. Yeah, we've done oh, yeah. Uh, storyboarding for a couple of my music videos uh, for uh, Cross the Atlantic and what was the other one? Be Good to Me. Cross be the Atlantic and Be Good to Me. And then I thought right away, I just said, I think it's time now to collaborate musically with Candence uh, as a writer. And uh, yeah. to write the lyrics and and it just it, it came together it was amazing yeah so you worked out you reached out to me you said what exactly how do you write a song about the 23rd psalm and we just got to thinking it's a song about being fearless that's what it that's what it's about yeah. and so we wanted to capture something that was a very universal theme about being confident and being fearless it didn't take you long too and what what better way to articulate that than to have someone who feels that no one is superior to him no one is better than him, and to have the confidence to look at a supermodel and say she is inside my league. No matter who she is, she's in my league. That would be one example. That would be that an example. That was the example we ran with. That was an example that we settled <laughs> with because it is an example. It's a very accessible example that everybody understands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We built the the lyrics based off of that, and you just kind of had all these goofy ideas about, oh, she's in my league, or, you know, this is my league, and I said, no. So inside my league, and you didn't like it. You were you were ambivalent, but I then the I sold you. Theme I might have thought of, and I told, said, and then you mm -hmm. really you kind of said, right, here's what the title needs to be. Yes. So you were ambivalent. We talked a little bit. We got it together. Sent it to Juan. Um, he surprisingly, I was just kind of nervous. I was an amateur, um, but he surprisingly really liked it yeah. and appreciated well, I saw, it. I did a, a one verse and a chorus. Sent it to him, and he pretty much got the idea of the direction I was going. And that, though, he was so impressed that he went and uh, retooled the music mm -hmm. uh, and gave it a little more of a, a different uh, sort of genre feel and rearranged parts based on what I performed. And then, and then in turn, when he sent it back to me, we did this remote. He's again, he's based in Madrid. I'm in New York. We're in Virginia now, by mm -hmm. the way. Mm -hmm. It's a global project. It's a global project. And, uh, and now we have Vancouver in the mix. And now we have Vancouver in the mix. We got Anna G, lovely model, Miss Miss Russia Radio. Um, very, very well-known model in Russia. We somehow talked her into going to Mexico to shoot the video with you. We did 10 days of shooting in Cancun. We just shot uh, just amazing footage along beaches and resorts. And uh, it was a perfect setting. And now we sent the, all the footage back to Madrid to the studios. And Juan and his production team are working on the video. Mm -hmm. And so in about two weeks, we're, 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 we're eager to, to finally launch this thing. It's going to be the video, the single, 
Uh, he's got a producer that's also working on a remix. Mm -hmm. January 20th yeah. is pending release, worldwide release, of the song and the video. There's another release on Gotta Keep Faith Records, which will be uh, will be coming out around the end of January, early February 2013, and it's uh, not Goodbye to Goodbye, that's the other song we wrote. That's the song we collaborated on, um, okay. Right, yes. but uh, before that one, that'll be the second release on Gotta Keep Faith Records. The first one is... Here Comes Again. Is Here Comes Again. Yeah. And so anyway, well, you Gotta can... Keep Faith Records, they helped you with your original album. They did, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They are in Italy. They are based They're in Italy, in, in Italy, Milan, yes. and um, I will be... So I have two major releases on two different record labels in Europe, and uh, you can find out all the information on mrshy.com, mr-shy.com, and yeah, that's that's about it. So, so yeah, I think this is the end of our time in, in Virginia together. Yeah. So yeah. we wanted to say special thanks out, special thanks to Juan Belmonte and Thank everybody you, in Spain. Hi, Juan. Special thanks to Anna G and uh, the the facilitating getting her to Mexico for the video. Wherever you are, Anna. <laughs> In Vancouver. Um, special thanks to Steve, <laughs> our, our, product, our producer for this yeah. video, and special thanks to Teresa Wood for being the production assistant. The production assistant. Took a lot of people to get this together, and we really hope that you guys like it, and there's more to come in 2013. Yes. Happy New Year. Here, Mr. Yes. Shy remixed um, lots of really great songs on here. I yeah. think this is probably what sold him on working with you, because you have songs like "Be Good to Me" that are just kind of the essence of a relationship. Yeah, well, the CD, the original album, is mm -hmm. what he had that because uh, he did his uh, remix, which is not on this album. That was a couple years before this came out. This is two years ago, but this is a compilation because I worked with a lot of different producers uh, around the world uh, who did remixes of my, my album "Superstar." And so we put out Mr. Shy Remix, and this is on my record label, <coughs> New Soul Records. Mm -hmm. There were two songs on here that we had done videos for in yes. the past. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but we you had were, done you videos. Were involved, I, I, was, I was script writing. I wasn't yeah. songwriting, but I was helping you script write. Script writing phase. Now you're yeah. in both phases. I'm just, I'm, I'm really just getting involved in it. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. Oh. I think it's time to put on our glasses. It is time for the glasses. The 2013 <laughs> glasses. The 2013 glasses. <laughs> Imaginary toast. Imaginary toast. We got our champagne. Ding, ding. <laughs>